Hello everybody, welcome to The Geek's Handbag, coming to you from somewhere in the middle of nowhere. I hope you're keeping well. Today I'm going to be pulling these out of the bag to take a look at. It's the new Doctor Who Kawaii collection by Titans. And here they are. Yes, I've got all these to open right in front of your very eyes. Kawaii, meaning cute or adorable in Japanese. So, let's see which figures we can get in this set. So we've got all the Doctors up to the 12th Doctor. I'm particularly looking forward to seeing what the 4th, 6th and 7th Doctor looks like, especially Colin, he looks really colourful. Uh, there's a couple of variants, obviously. There's the War Doctor. Now this is the figure I really, really want. I can't have all the Doctors and not have the brilliant War Doctor. There's a couple of variants as well. There's a ninth Doctor, I think he's got a different colour T-shirt. 10th Doctor variant, different colour suit. And this is the one I would love to get. It's a variant of the 5th Doctor, um, and I believe he's wearing his costume from Castrovalva. So those are the figures. Let's open some boxes. So the first box, very exciting. Just give you a quick spin of the packaging. So we've got the Doctors there with a bit of the 12th Doctor Time Vortex. On the side, there's those Doctors. On the back, we've got the 10th Doctor in his funky 3D shades. And on the other side, it's the rest of the Doctors. So which one will this be? First box. Imagine if we got the War Doctor straight away. War Doctor or fourth would be my preference. And it is, first Doctor out of the box is, it's the 10th Doctor in Funky Shades. Yes, 10th Doctor in 3D specs, and he looks funky. I like him. He's the regular variant with the blue suit. I always like the blue suit. As you can see, he does come with a Sonic. Yeah, it's a nice figure. Good one to start with. Happy with him. Okay, second box. Right, hoping for um, the fourth Doctor, actually. I really want to see what he looks like. And I feel a scarf in there. No, it feels like quite a small figure. Second figure out of the box is oh, big hair. Oh, it's a it's another tenth Doctor in funky shades, but different colour suit. Yes, it's our old mate, the tenth Doctor. This time it's the Chase variant wearing the brown suit. He also comes with a trusty Sonic, so it's nice to have a Chase variant. Just compare him to the other one I just got. Uh, the regular one is a two in eighteen. This one slightly rarer, so he's a one in thirty six. Okay, I've had enough temp doctors now, so let's have a classic doctor, please. Fourth doctor or six would be good, or seventh with his little umbrella. Um, yeah, classic doctor, please. Oh, can see it's Peter. Oh, it's the variant of the fifth doctor, Castrovalva. Yes, fifth doctor in his costume from Castrovalva just after regenerating. I'm really pleased to have got this figure. Out of all the chase figures, him and the war doctor are the two that I really, really want. So chuffed to bits to have got him. It's a lovely figure actually, wearing the fourth doctor's waistcoat, trousers and boots that he had on. Just give you a quick spin. Lovely detail on that. I'm very, very pleased to have got him. Right, box number four, and I've just realised I've already got two of the Chase variants, so that might mean I don't get my beloved War Doctor, but we'll see. Oh gosh, this one's glued down tight, so box number four. Hoping for another classic, actually, would be good. And it is. Oh, it's got an accessory, whoever it is. Oh, desperate. It's, uh, it's the 11th Doctor. Yay, it's the 11th Doctor, and he looks good. And of course he comes with his trusty sonic screwdriver. The 11th Doctor, very rarely seen without it. Yeah, it's a nice figure, like the little patches on his jacket, and of course he's wearing his trademark bow tie. Okay, so far so good. Box number five, I haven't had any duplicates yet, so I probably shouldn't tempt fate saying that, should I? Where is Doctor number four? That's uh, one I really wanna see, come on. This one is, oh, looks like another 10th Doctor. Yeah, it is, it's a variant of the 10th Doctor. So, five boxes in and our first duplicate. Yes, it's the 10th Doctor in his blue suit. They actually look really cool lined up like that, don't they? Look like they're watching a movie. I hope it's the Paul McGann TV movie. Okay, we need some more classic Doctors now, please. Ah, this one's very easy to open. All right. And next out of the box, it is. Hey, it's Capaldi himself. Yeah, it's the grumpy 12th Doctor. I love the 12th Doctor. Um, I think this one's based on the slightly later version because he's got his bigger hair and his own Sonic there, which they've done a nice job on. Just giving you a quick twirl. Yes, he's wearing his hoodie. That's a nice figure. I like the 12th Doctor. 
Right, box number seven. Will it be lucky number seven? Will it be the war doctor? I'm starting to worry that I'm not going to get him. I should be a little bit upset if I don't. But anyway, can't complain. Right, box number seven is where's the tag here it is box of it all oh, i can see a sonic so i think it's another 11th doctor yes it is yeah second duplicate it's the 11th doctor river song would approve wouldn't she geronimo okie dokie box number eight lucky number eight there's no such thing as a lucky number eight but come on maybe in an alternative universe number eight was lucky right oh this one feels a bit bigger uh so it could be the fourth maybe and it, it, oh no, it's got an except, oh no, it's um, Fifth Doctor again. Oh yes, Fifth Doctor with his celery. Drop the Sonic device. Yes, he's got a trusty Sonic screwdriver, which is nice. I love the Fifth Doctor. Um, he was the Doctor I grew up watching, so I've always liked him. Uh, it's great to have a figure of him. Just give you a quick twirl with his big flowing yellow hair. Yeah, great figure. Okay, the last box of the first layer, box number nine, right. See, it's doing quite well so far, but uh, I think um, we need to start filling in those classic gaps. Uh, I can see an accessory. Oh, it's another Capaldi. Yep, duplicate of the 12th Doctor, so double the angry face. Okay, guys, we're into the second layer, and I can feel little beads of sweat starting to appear on my forehead because there's a lot of classic Doctors I haven't got yet, so we'll start to worry when the boxes start to diminish and I haven't got all the figures. So, box number 10 is... Don't be another tent for Capaldi. No, it's not. Oh, how cool. One of my favourite Doctors, number seven. Yes, the seventh Doctor. I think this might be my favourite figure so far because I do love the seventh Doctor. And they've done a good job on him. He's got his question mark pullover. He's got the scarf. He's got the shoes. He's got the hat. He's got it all going on. And yes, he does come with his trademark question mark umbrella. So he's brilliant. I really like him. Okay, next box, right, we're starting to get really into it now. Uh, come on, we've got to have the fourth Doctor, surely. Let's have a fourth Doctor. Oh, can see an accessory. Oh, it's uh, Doctor number nine. Fantastic. Here you are, rules and the nap, Doctor Fantastic. Sorry, I won't do the impression. Um, so there he is, the ninth Doctor. I actually really like this figure. Uh, he's got his uh, sonic screwdriver. Um, they've got the ears right, haven't they? Uh, just give you a quick twirl. Yeah, ninth Doctor is um, very basic in his costume, isn't he? And uh, I'm colour blind, so I can't actually tell um, what colour that T-shirt is. But I'm assuming he's just the regular 1 in 18 figure and not the variant. But either way, I like him. Okay, next box. And, uh, you know... I'd really like to see the Six Doctors colourful coat. So, so I need a bit of colour in my life right now. So let's have, uh, let's hope it's him. Here's the tag. There it is. And it's, oh, it's another accessory. Oh, it's, uh, it's the third Doctor. Oh yes, Mr. Pertwee. Jump in Jehoshaphat. It's the third Doctor. Yes, and doesn't he look stylish in his frilly shirt? He even got the frills around the cuffs there, which is nice. He comes with his trusty Sonic. Uh, my favourite of all the Sonics, the third Doctor one. And of course, he's got his big bouffant hair. So, welcome to the collection, third Doctor. Okay, guys, six boxes left and there's at least five Doctors and a couple of chase variants that I haven't got yet. So... Don't really need any more duplicates. We need to complete the collection with those doctors. God, this one's difficult to open. Right. Okay, where's the tag? Wanna spare your ears? Right, this one is. Yeah, <laughs> yes. The first doctor. So the first Doctor, hmm, the original you might say, nice figure, I like the costume they've gone with and he's also got his trademark ring on his finger as well which is a nice bit of detail, just give you a quick spin. I thought they might have given him an accessory like his walking stick or something but either way he looks really good. Okay, five boxes left and we still need the second Doctor, the fourth Doctor, the sixth Doctor and the eighth Doctor. So, come on. Where's number four? I've been wanting him since we started. I really need to get that figure. Come on. Please be the fourth Doctor. Or the six. <laughs> and it is... Oh, okay. No, that's, that's equally as good. It's the second Doctor. Yes, hot on the heels of the first Doctor. It's the second Doctor with his big moppy hair. I thought they might have given him an accessory as well, like a flute or something. But either way, he looks good. He's rocking the bow tie as well, giving the 11th Doctor a run for his money. Yep. Nice figure. Okay, only four boxes left, right. Oh gosh, go so quick, okay. 
The next figure out of the bag is, come on, who's this? Pertwee again. But hang on a cotton picking minute because that's not Pertwee, that's the fourth Doctor in the third Doctor's outfit. And he's not even on the box, which means he must be one of the super rare or ultra rare chase figures. I think there's a couple of them floating around out there. There's the ultra rare, which is the ninth Doctor in the War Doctor costume. And then I guess this is the other one. Um, I've no idea what percentage he is, but yeah, I'm really pleased to have got him. I thought I'd got another duplicate, so bonus. Only three boxes left, people, and uh, no sign of the fourth or sixth Doctor yet, or the eighth Doctor. So, who is this? It is, I, I'm pretty sure that's the sixth Doctor's hair. I thought so, Mr. Colourful himself. So yes, the sixth Doctor in all his colourfulness, and um, personally, I love his outfit, and I especially like it when I get figures of him, because I think it looks brilliant. Just give you a quick twirl. They've done a great job on the coat, and he's got his trademark cap there on the lapel. He looks really good. In fact, um, I think he might have just crept up to being my favourite figure in the set so far. Okay, only two boxes left, and I still don't have the fourth Doctor, the eighth Doctor, or the War Doctor, so, come on, who's it going to be? Um, ah, it's a difficult choice, because I'm not going to get one of those. Um, I really want the fourth, so please let me get the fourth. And it is the, okay, it's McGann, it's the eighth Doctor. Yes, it's the Doctor, but maybe not the one who's expecting the eighth Doctor. And I really love the costume on this. It looks great. It looks like he means business. Just give you a quick twirl. One day he will become the War Doctor, of course, but for now, I'm actually really happy with him. He looks good. Oh my goodness, people, only one box left, look. And I do like that vortex pattern in the box. That's very cool, right. Okay then, so, oh gosh, there's uh, two figures that I didn't get. So I'm hoping it's one of those. So fourth Doctor or War Doctor or a duplicate, I guess, or a chase figure, but let's see. To be honest with you, I really want the fourth Doctor, so I've got all the classics. Um, as much as I would have loved the War Doctor. So, which one is it in this final box? Oh, thank goodness for that! It's the fourth Doctor. Yes, come on in, season 18 Doctor, and all your burgundy loveliness. Oh, thank goodness I got this figure because I love the fourth Doctor. I also love the season 18 costume that he wears, and this looks really nice. He's got his trusty Sonic. Just give you a quick twirl. Nice little buttons on the back of the coat there. So, thank goodness, the fourth Doctor completes the set, and uh, if only there was a nice little canine figure to go with him. Hmm, maybe in the future, eh? So these blind boxes are available individually for around £7.99 each where you take a chance on which figure you get or you can purchase the full set for around about £129.99. I realise these figures may not appeal to everyone but I like the fact Titans are trying something different. Admittingly when they first announced this set I was a little unsure about it myself but having now seen the figures in hand I really like them. And I'm very pleased with the rare chase figures I managed to get, especially the Regeneration 4th Doctor. So overall I think this is a really nice collection, and it's good to have something a little bit different added to the Doctor Who universe. Kawaii, kawaii. Right, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing video. Comment below and let me know what you think of this set. Right, that's it for me for now. So in the meantime, do check out thegeekshandbag.com for more bits and bobs from me. I'm also on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram, so do say hello on there. As well as that, I do a weekly Doctor Who podcast with Gary that goes at every Friday called The Big Blue Box Podcast, so give that a listen. And until the next time, guys, take care. Bye-bye!